Hello, and welcome back to our YouTube channel. On Mars, NASA's Curiosity rover captured a beautiful, fragile creation that appears to be a branching piece of ocean coral. It's not coral, but it's interesting to consider how we see similar Earth objects on Mars in strange patterns. The tiny Martian sculpture elicits poetic analogies. It resembles the tendrils of an anemone in a tide pool or a water droplet captured at the moment of bursting against a surface. Today in this video, we will show what Curiosity rover uncovered, and we will also discuss about Curiosity rover for those of you who are not familiar with it. Let's get started without further ado. While gathering geological data on green hue grasses, the structure was discovered. Photographs of small, unique geological concretes, with an appearance similar to that of coral, or cacti, were taken by NASA's Curiosity probe, between days 3396 and 3397 of its mission to Mars. While gathering data on sedimentary rocks at the base of Greenhue, according to the Space Agency. Curiosity, the United States' fourth rover to Mars, was launched on November 26, 2011 and landed on August 5, 2012. Due to signs of water being present in the ancient past, NASA chose the crater as a landing site for Curiosity, which landed on Mars in November 2011. NASA's Jet Propulsion Laboratory is leading the expedition, which includes almost 500 scientists from the United States and other countries. Curiosity is exploring a 154-kilometer-wide, 96-mile-wide, gale crater and collecting rock, soil, and air samples for study on board. The rover, which is roughly the size of a basketball player, has a 2.1-meter, 7-foot, long arm that it uses to deploy instruments close to rocks chosen for investigation. Its huge size enables it to transport a sophisticated set of scientific apparatus. The Mars Hand Lens Imager, MALI, is a rover-based version of the magnifying hand lens that geologists typically bring into the field. The new MALI image depicts flower-like and spherical rock debris on the surface of the Gale Crater, which was obtained on February 24, 2022, 3396 Martian day, of the mission. The image was generated by combining two to eight photographs obtained by the Mars Hand Lens Imager, which is housed in a turret at the rover's robotic arm's end. Focus merging was utilized to combine the numerous photos in such a way that as many of the elements as possible were brought into focus. Minerals carried by water cemented the rock in the ancient past, resulting in these objects. In the past, Curiosity has identified a broad array of comparable tiny structures that originated when mineralizing fluids moved through condits in the rock, the Curiosity team explained. Images of such features are assisting us in learning more about the Gale Crater's lengthy history of liquid water. It was confirmed by the Curiosity team to be a diagenetic crystal cluster. It is made up of three-dimensional crystal clusters, produced from a combination of minerals, and while it appears enormous in the photographs, it is actually less than a cent. According to NASA experts, it can reveal more about the structure of Martian soil as well as how the planet may have appeared in the past. It's referred to as a diagenetic crystal cluster, with diagenetic referring to mineral recombination, which in this case is most likely due to flowing water. The minerals, which sprung out in different directions, were presumably embedded inside a rock that eroded away over time, according to earlier versions. However, the minerals appear to be resistant to erosion and hence linger on Mars' dusty surface, according to NASA scientists. The structure is also known as concretion, and it was dubbed blueberries because it was small and round, as it was seen by the Opportunity rover, which is no longer operational. In 2013, Curiosity discovered a similar flower-like structure, and the Spirit rover discovered rocks it dubbed cauliflower because of their knobbly protuberances. Next to the flower-like feature, the same type of blueberry-like structure seen by Opportunity can be seen in the latest Curiosity photograph. The NASA Curiosity rover team called this feature Blackthorn Salt and used Marley to get a close-up image of minerals and textures. While Curiosity is making headlines for discovering microscopic crystal formations, Perseverance, Curiosity's twin on Mars, is commemorating a significant anniversary. The rover celebrated its one-year anniversary on the planet on February 21. The high-tech robot was dispatched to Mars by NASA to look for evidence of life. It has not yet spotted any small green men, as far as we know. It has, nevertheless, made several significant discoveries. The rover's primary mission has been to collect rock samples and conduct experiments. And it's been relaying its results back to Earth the whole time. Now let's talk about Curiosity rover. 
Curiosity is a car-sized Mars rover that is part of NASA's Mars Science Laboratory (MSL) mission to explore the Gale Crater on Mars. Curiosity was launched from Cape Canaveral on November 26, 2011, and landed on Mars on August 6, 2012, on Eolus Palace inside Gale Crater. After a 560 million kilometer trek, the rover's touchdown destination was less than 2.4 kilometers from the Bradbury landing site. The mission's objectives include a study of the Martian climate and geology, a determination of whether the chosen field site inside Gale has ever provided favorable environmental conditions for microbial life, including a look at the role of water, and planetary habitability studies in preparation for human exploration. Curiosity's two-year mission was extended indefinitely in December 2012, and NASA commemorated the fifth anniversary of the Curiosity rover landing on August 5, 2017. Curiosity has been operating on Mars for 3417 sols, or 3,511 total days, as of March 18, 2022, it has been 9 years and 224 days since its arrival. The National Aeronautic Association presented the NASA JPL Mars Science Laboratory Curiosity Project team with the 2012 Robert J. Collier Trophy in recognition of the extraordinary achievements of successfully landing Curiosity on Mars, advancing the nation's technological and engineering capabilities, and significantly improving humanity's understanding of ancient Martian habitable environments, according to the National Aeronautic Association. Curiosity's rover architecture is being used to develop NASA's Perseverance mission, which will launch in 2021 and carry a variety of scientific instruments. Curiosity will reach a momentous milestone later this year, its 10-year anniversary on Mars. On August 5, 2012, the Curiosity rover touched down on Mars. For the past decade, it has been exploring the crater and the Mount Sharp Peak at the crater's center. The mission's goal was to see if Mars may ever be hospitable for microbial life. The aptly named rover found chemical and mineral evidence confirming the planet's habitability in the distant past early on. Since then, Curiosity has been studying the geologic record to figure out when Mars was most likely to harbor life. Only after a successful entrance, descent, and landing on the Martian surface did previous NASA Mars rovers become operational. Curiosity, on the other hand, was operational when it landed on Mars' surface, using the rover suspension system to complete the final set down. Curiosity was changed from its stowed flying mode to a landing configuration, while the MSL spacecraft lowered it beneath the spacecraft descent stage with a 20M rope from the sky crane system to a soft landing, wheels down, on Mars' surface. After confirming that it was on solid ground, the rover fired several pyrotechnic fasteners, which activated cable cutters on the bridle, allowing it to escape the spacecraft descent stage. The descent stage then flew away, crashing to the ground, and the rover prepared to start the science section of the mission. Curiosity discovered enough carbon in ancient Mars rocks and soils to serve as a raw ingredient for life, assuming it ever existed. Curiosity discovered a variety of organic compounds in the lakebed rocks of Gale Crater. The majority are short, with only a few carbon atoms in length. Curiosity is performing admirably, given that it has been on Mars for 10 years and has achieved five times its minimum target. Something catastrophic could happen at any point to shorten the mission's lifespan, but if that does not happen, the mission's lifespan is restricted by its plutonium power source. NASA will have to progressively reduce the rover's activities over the following decade. The video for today has come to an end. If you enjoyed this video, please give it a thumbs up, subscribe to the channel and press the bell button if you want to see more of this type of content. What are your thoughts on the discovery by Curiosity? How long do you think the rover will last? Please let us know in the comment section below. We will see you in the next video, thank you for watching.